What's up guys? Welcome to A History Of In 90 Seconds. Today we're going to be taking a look at Wolverine. Wolverine was created by Lynn Wine, John Romita, and Roy Thomas. He made his cameo appearance in Incredible Hulk 180, but made his first full appearance in Incredible Hulk 181. He was born as James Hallett Hudson in 1832. He's known as a healer with the mutant healing factor. And although that he can heal, he actually still feels pain, and he can't suppress that. He served in both World War I and World War II. He was imprisoned by the Weapon X program and experimented on. They effused adamantium into his bones. Once completed, they sent him to stop the destruction of the battle between Hulk and Wendigo, as seen in The Incredible Hulk 181. In 1982, he was given a four-part series that was done by Chris Claremont and Frank Miller. Wolverine in comics is actually five foot three, but he was portrayed on screen by six foot three inch Hugh Jackman. Wolverine also starred in the 90s X-Men animated series. Professor X would later recruit Wolverine to join his new iteration of superheroes seen in Giant Size X-Men number one. He would go on to create a relationship with Jean Grey. From there, there'd be many battles, books, miniseries, and comic runs, as well as story arcs. Wolverine famously dies in Logan, but is resurrected in Marvel Legacy 1. That's followed up by the return of the Wolverine miniseries. Wolverine is expected to be recast and prominently featured in the new X-Men series of movies coming up. So that's it. There's 90 seconds of your favorite Canadian superhero. Who would you like me to do next? Leave a comment down below. Please like and subscribe. Thanks, guys.